Identity 5 has a lot of grass so today. We are going to talk about it and how interesting it is. On Red Church, the grass is very separated from each other. Since the married couples were actually cows, at their wedding they ate a lot of the grass. Leaving barely anything of what once was, the grass is also very weak. Since the cows left nobody to do satanic rituals for rain. On Arms Factory, the grass is common due to the fact the factory was out of work for ages because people like arson. The grass looks very lively because, unlike Red Church, there is a guy that likes puppets here who does rituals on a daily basis. On Sacred Hospital, the grass is interesting. The main use that it has is for drugs. Since the hospital loved to throw chemicals out the window, which made the grass have weird properties. Try it and test your luck. You might get haste too, or fucking insta-death. On Lakeside Village, the grass is healthy. Do the fact that the land is right next to a clean ocean. Also, the villagers there did a lot of rituals. To for the sushi god, which made the grass superior than others. On Moonlit, we have a very rare species of healthy French grass. Our security cameras have caught the grass talking. Here is the clip. I'm sorry to say that I'm sorry to say that I'm French. I'm sorry to say I'm sorry to say that I'm sorry to say the grass is healthy because there is a river in the middle of the map which provides a lot of minerals. On Leo's memory, the grass is pretty much on the edge of being dead. Since it's in a constant frozen state, there is nothing we can do to save it. So, it will most likely go extinct soon. On ever sleeping, there doesn't seem to be any kind of grass. And no, bushes are not a type of grass, so fuck them. On Asylum, the only grass that can be found is made out of plastic. This was a choice to prevent patients from eating it, instead of the given food. On Chinatown, there is only concrete in sight. Good luck finding grass in here. On Golden Cave, we barely have grass since Prospector ate it all. But what remains is pretty dead due to the place getting bombed for mining 24-7. On Dark Woods, most of the grass is pretty toxic since Orpheus got a bit silly and put chemicals in the only source of water, contaminating every living thing. Remember, if it moves, it will most certainly also bite. On race course, the grass is very, very healthy. Since there are a lot of horses who produce a lot of natural fertilizer, it helps us to create a healthy environment for a very good-looking grass. This is the end of the documentary. Hope it helps you to understand the Identity 5 grass better.